Okay, next presentation is final presentation. It's given by uh, Miss Yuri Sasaki from Tokyo University. Title is Breaking the Wall of Vaccine and Adjuvant. Hello, everyone. Do you know the word of Adjuvant? It is from the Latin Adjuvar, which means help. Most vaccines include substances that increase the efficacy of the vaccine. Exactly, these substances are adjuvants. In particular, they stimulate the production of antibodies and enhance the potency of the antigen itself. Moreover, adjuvants reduce the dose of antigen or the number of immunization needed to achieve immunity. Then, do adjuvants have only helpful aspects? Unfortunately, the answer is no. Adjuvants sometimes cause serious side effects. For example, aluminum is the most commonly used chemical adjuvant. It sometimes causes chronic fatigue, paralysis, and asthma. Several people are suffering from serious symptoms. The next one may be you. So the wall we have to break down is adverse effects of adjuvants. <coughs> Together with my research team, I aim to limit side effects of vaccines by finding a more tolerable adjuvant. Our solution is to use a laser as a safe and effective physical adjuvant instead of chemical adjuvants. Using light is dramatically innovative. While chemical adjuvants travel inside the whole body through the bloodstream, the laser can be targeted locally, thus reducing potential side effects. The exposure is local and temporary, so the laser doesn't stay in tissues. Actually, such as spot removal and laser surgery, Contrary to chemical substances, the laser treatment has been used much more safely for many decades. Here is how the laser adjuvant works. While applying the laser on the skin, more immune cells respond and gather around the treated area than without the laser. As a consequence, after administration of the vaccine, much more antibodies are being produced, boosting the efficacy of the vaccine. We are now applying a laser adjuvant in a clinical setting. We expect to achieve immunization with minimal side effects. I hope this project will save a lot of people from infectious diseases. Thank you for listening. <laughs>